Later this month, we will mark 10 years since the shooting at Chardon High School, one day that took the life of students Danny Parmeter, Demetrius Hewlin, and Russell King. And since then, the school's football coach, whose actions on that day have been called heroic, has made it his mission to improve school safety. Four years ago, then-Governor John Kasich signed a bill giving Ohio schools the opportunity to get funds for school safety and mental health. And now as we reflect on what happened 10 years ago, News 5's Clay Lepard tells us that same coach is looking to inspire more change, one act at a time. Inside her Chardon home. You can see those are notes written from my kids. Kindness is Carrie Wilman's calling card. Yeah, if it says kind on it, I'll buy it. <laughs> this mother of five with a coffee table covered in her business's kindness is spending the month making an extra effort to impart this virtue on her children. We're choosing one kind thing to do every day. Just something really silly that doesn't include money. It's not spending any money. Um, just one little thing every day. I have a little note on my iPad and we keep giving each other ideas. She's following the advice of one of Chardon's most recognizable faces. Be kind to other people and their memories in your thoughts. Coach Frank Hall cemented his leadership nearly 10 years ago. Every day you think about what you could have done to stop it. When he was credited with chasing a teenage shooter out of Chardon High School. Now he's kicking off a new initiative, a catalyst meant to make school a little safer. We just wanted to keep Danny, Demetrius, and Russell's memory alive. So for the month of February, the Coach Hall Foundation is asking everyone to take part with one small act of kindness every day through February 27th. A chance to extend a helping hand in a small way. Something that will, will help them get through the day. And then hopefully if you do one in, uh, intentional act every day, uh, it becomes a habit. And then it goes beyond February 27th and it goes through, you know, the rest of their life. Small gestures leaving a large impact inside the classroom and out in the community. Hopefully it'll just keep growing and growing and uh, we'll see great things happen. You can be kind because kindness is free. In Chardon, Clay Lepard, News 5. Now to learn more about this initiative and the Coach Hall Foundation, just head to news5cleveland.com and look for this story.